Hello, um, this is a small demo for uh, uh, Smart Water Mobile OpenGL ES uh, 1.1. Um, I made a special version of um, Smart Water that is an extension of Smart Water Basic and has to be installed on the top of uh, Smart Water Basic. And this extension just interpolates all the parameters for uh, Smart Water Basic. And to and make them compatible with Open GLES uh, 1.1, which is the first generation of um, iPhones, and probably it's working with uh, Android as well. So um, the good thing with um, uh, with uh, Smart Water for mobile is that uh, almost everything, well, everything from Smart Water Basic is also working. Uh, for mobile now. So for example if I select um, an example scene like the, the clean, clean, clean water <coughs> this is the um, an example for um, smart water basic you can see it here Uh, it will work as well for um, mobile now. So here is the the editor, and um, if I select here Smart Water OpenGL One Pass, for example, I will have the same thing um, for 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 OpenGL ES. So here is. It can work on um, uh, in in the editor, or it can work when you play. For example, I can here I, I can switch back in real time from basic to OpenGL ES, and there is another version where you can tweak the the caustics. So, for example, the trans transparency, all these parameters, they are compatible together. If I change the color of the water, for example, mm, it will change the color of the water here too. Uh, the water support going under the water so let's go back to some kind of normal water and here I can select the camera I go under the water and here it is go up go down go up go down and uh, it's working as well uh, with um, On iPhone, iPad 2, so you can so I I don't I cannot make the demo on an iPad, but I can tell you that I've tested on an iPad and it's working. <laughs> so, uh, for example, I can here I can select the graphic emulation to shader mod model 1 and you see it's, it's exa exactly the same and uh, I can then change to smart water basic and you see it's not supported of course and I can have the two different water I made these uh, two paths because um, in some situation you don't want to have the caustics maybe so that's why uh, you can uh, change the size of the caustics and if you change the size of the caustics it will change for every version let's go back to the no emulation thing so I can see in one pass you see the caustics are the same and here the caustics are a little bit mo more but they are bigger I can change the, the size here you see you 
you can see that the editor change depends on what kind of uh, water you selected now um, for um, for mobile platform I have um, created a special um, scene oh, no that's my water pro here it is with a two joystick control preset <laughs> and so uh, here I cannot really test it with an iPad I have don't have an iPad connected but um, I can show you a little bit what's happening so if I run the script uh, I have a uh, smart water for OpenGL ES 1.11 pass here and I, I can play <laughs> if I move my camera um, the player is here yeah I have to move the player player is falling inside yeah I can watch ooh, ooh, not oh no don't fall come here come back Oops, plooch. I can maybe watch up so I think uh, it's um, about everything about um, smart water for mobile platform OpenGL ES uh, 1.1 I hope you enjoyed this video Thank you.